Hi everyone, it's Anne Bordelow, the Spiritual Energy Chef. And today I'm here to talk to you about spirituality in business. Um, so what is it when you, when you hear the word spirituality or when you think about spirituality, what does it, that exactly mean to you? Or how do you define that? I know that there's a lot of um, history behind that word. Um, spirituality there is a lot of um, probably negative connotations now because people immediately think to spirituality is related to new age and it's all woo-woo stuff so I'm here to kind of dispel that rumor because things have changed the energy has definitely shifted um, in the last couple of years for sure and why you need to know about spirituality and how that's going to work in, in your business, specifically in terms of clearing the energy. So my definition of spirituality is that one-on-one -on -one connection with uh, the, the divine source. You can call it whatever you like. You can call it God, you can call it the universe, you can call it a higher power, whatever it is that you want to, to name it. Um, that feels comfortable for you. That's that that one-on-one -on -one connection It's that personal connection that you have with the universe or with that divine source How that differs from religion is that I feel like religion is an organized community Which is great if you want that support um, But there's a lot of stuff um, a lot of rules and regulations that go along with religion um, That don't resonate with a lot of people myself included so how does that translate into business? Well, if you think about your, how you connect with business, I mean, we all have customers, right? We all have clients. Well, so if you look at business and being that one-on-one -on -one connection between your company or yourself and your clients, then that really is a spiritual connection. And there's a, a uh, phrase that uh, that I hear all the time in the networking events or the networking groups that I go to here in Las Vegas and I'm sure that it's the same not only across the, 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 uh, the country but also across the world as well where if you want you want to do business with people that you know like and trust and I get that and, and I'm totally all for that so how do you even get to know like and trust people your energy is your calling card and so if you had a line of, say, five people that all did the same exact thing, they were all in the same industry, how would you choose? You're going to resonate with whoever it is, is on the same energetic vibration that you are. Because in, in reality, it's not about the product that you're selling. It's a, you're actually buying from that person. You, that person resonates with you. You know that they're gonna do a good job. You just have that, that good feeling, that positive feeling about them. And so you really wanna make sure that not only for yourself, but for your employees, that you're keeping your energy clear. Um, how many times have, if you work in a company that, uh, a big corporation or even a, a small mom and pop um, brick and mortar where you have one person that is constantly in a bad mood, just very negative, and that totally brings down the morale for everyone in the, the whole company, the whole team. And so how do you get around that? It's about clearing that energy. And that's what I like to work with with people. I, my goal is to have people figure out what it is, what that root cause is of that, that negative energy that, that's coming up, that's manifesting for that person in that way. Whether it be um, through stress, depression, fatigue, PTSD, um, anger, fear, anxiety, those are all things that are manifesting. And then it could also be manifesting in a physical way as well with aches and pains and you know the, those phantom things that you go to the doctor and they do run all of these tests and they have no medical reason why you're feeling the way that you're feeling it's energy that energy that has been stuffed down from a past experience that at that time maybe you because your brain was not mature enough or didn't understand what was happening was not able to process that type of trauma or that type of stress 
So now you've stuffed it down and it's, it's now manifesting itself in a completely different way and physical or mental or emotional. And so if you're not, if people are not working on that and processing it and clearing it, they're bringing it into the office. And how does that affect your business? How does that affect the relationships with your clients? It's, so it's really something that, um, it, it's important. You want your, your business to flourish. You want to raise that your business to a higher energetic level so you're bringing in the right kinds of customers. It's also about looking, energy clearing is also about looking at the environment that you have around you. Look at the physical environment. Do you have stacks of paper or files that are building up on your desk? And all of that, those piles are all collecting different kinds of energy. I am not a business mentor. I have I, a number of different wonderful people that are business mentors that can help you with that. I'm looking at things from just an energetic perspective. So when I look at, um, when I'm dealing with clients that have severe um, traumas that they're trying to re release and, and process through to re remove from the roots, um, there's also that correlation in business as well because those same clients are the ones that are going into, into work and bringing their issues with them and how is that affecting your business. So I'm all about looking out for the employees to help them take care of themselves, learning good ways of self-care, and then that way when they come into work, they're much happier, more productive employees. So that is my take on how spirituality actually fits in with business. So it's about not only the personal health, but also the business, business health as well. So I hope that's been helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. Um, I do have a program called Create a Recipe for the Life That You Deserve. It's an eight week boot camp that's online and it's all about um, teaching people self care, teaching them about energy and why energy is important, um, relationships, and having a vision, having some goals. So if, you're in, if that's something that you're interested in, whether you're interested in on a personal level or maybe something that you'd like to offer to your um, employees as part of their health care package, um, I would love to have a conversation with you about that.